back guys. This is Charm Bark Barbecue, where we love smoke rings and grilling things. On today's episode, I'm going to show y'all how I make my very own special famous salsa, at least in my family. I'm gonna show y'all how to do a smoked salsa recipe. All right guys, so first I'm going to um, do a little bit of a different technique. Well, actually you're just gonna cut off the ends here, all these jalapenos. So this recipe, I do like to half these jalapenos. So you can kind of get some of this uh, nice char. Because what we're going to do in this recipe is I'm going to put it on the smoker, but I'm going to use a cast iron skillet. And in a cast iron, I like to put a little bit of olive oil so it kind of, you know, chars it, gives it a little bit of a, a roast flavor. Um, you can quarter these onions. I'm probably going to just half it for this video. You know what? Let's just quarter them. I feel like if you have more surface area of roasting and char, it makes the sauce a little bit better. So also I have some uh, tomatoes. So I have four Roma tomatoes. Also I have garlic that I kind of chopped off the head part there and took the majority of the skin off. Um, like I said, also have the tomatoes and then also I have three tomatillos. Um, this is kind of how I like to do my salsa. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna place this in this bowl with all these ingredients. I'm gonna wait to save for the jalapenos and I'll put some olive oil on these. I, I guess I'll just show you right now. I just have to drizzle some olive oil on this, on these veggies. mix this around or gets it coated. All right guys, so this is how I assemble my cast iron. I just kind of like to place it sporadically. Um, I did put some olive oil on top where the uh, seeds and the veins of the jalapenos are and I'll kind of show you a little bit closer. It's kind of what it looks like. Um, looks really tasty. So what we're gonna do now, we'll go ahead and take it out and put it on the smoker. All right guys, so we're gonna put the uh, cast iron on here. Just gonna place it kind of right over where the heat is at the igniter of the smoker on that side to kind of let it have the majority of the heat on that plate let it do its work all right guys so i went ahead and took the vegetables off of the smoker off the cast iron and i did decide to actually throw them in the cast iron just on the stove top there just to kind of give it some more char um, some more grill marks and everything so that's kind of what it's going to look like what you want it to look like finished product um, you want to have that nice you know roasted peppers the onions uh, they just look delicious. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna place all this in our Ninja Blender. I'm gonna blend it up um, also with some cilantro, you know, salt and pepper and kind of go from there. salsa it is going to have a lighter color to it than it would after you let it sit for a while I'm gonna stir this around I'm gonna let it cool just for a couple minutes and I'll try it all right guys so this is the finished product this is the salsa let it cool down and sit out for a little while now we gotta try it see how it tastes Mm. So what I love about the salsa is that it has a slight smoky flavor. Obviously, we, we didn't you know smoke the veggies out in the in the pellet smoker on the YS640S for too long, so it's a slight smoky flavor, uh, but it is there, and it's not super spicy. So I hope you all like this video of this uh, recipe and and video of the smoked salsa. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe, and turn on the notification bell so you can get updates when we post new videos. Oh,